What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Zyox, it's the legendary one, and today we're doing a showcase on Askin, who is currently out on the thousand year Blood War banner. Um, I'm sure we're gonna see him in the anime, right? I didn't show him in the trailer, but we're probably gonna see him in the anime. Um, Askin is one of the better characters you could probably pull on the banner. I'd say he has the most usability in terms of the three showcases you guys are going to be seeing out there today. Uh, mainly because he is a PvP unit. He is good in PvE. I don't know too much people that actually still use him that much in PvE. I know back then, a couple months ago, I've seen a decent amount of people using him in co-op. But I'm not sure how much people use him in PvE. But uh, let's just pull up his stuff real quick and get on with the showcase. So... For Soul Trail, let me go on to that first. I have him 252. I didn't even really know that. Okay, let's go on to his thing first. So, he has damage taken negative 16%, right? He has Squad Zero Killer. Again, he is a PvP character, so that, in terms of PvE, is not good. There's literally no Squad Zero bosses or anything. That's a PvP exclusive type of killer. Quincy Stern Reel Affiliation, obviously. Um, In terms of his kit, he has Poison on his NAD. First strong attack, third strong attack, and then he has instant kill on his soul bomb. Now, this right here, I think, let me just double check. I think he is, what? Okay. I guess uh, multiple people have a second strong attack. No, not this specifically, but like they have like the way it works. But his first second strong attack is a defense down, which is really good. Right, you usually see this on ultimates like um Catfire and World Shuhei, he has this on his ultimate. So for asking to have this on his skill is very good. He is a NAD character, by the way. Because he's PvP. So let's just get into it. So he has uh Berserker 40%, right? Bruiser 30%. This is increased because of um Link, I guess. He has damage taken, obviously. Um Flurry plus one, paralysis resistance 100%, poison resistance 100%, and he has start barrier plus 10 with poise, which means um, for poise, if you guys don't know what poise means, it means that when an enemy hits him, he won't get pushed back and he will just keep fighting regardless. Um, on his accessories, I guess we only have one thing on. Um, I didn't set it up beforehand, so we're going to set it up now real quick so you guys can see what I put on these characters if you want. So because he is a NAD character, we're going to have to put on NAD stuff. Sadly for me, I don't really have NAD stuff for this kind of character. I mean, I have this Quinty Cross, right? Um, You're going to give him like the hunting cap. Or you're going to give him this actually. No, wait, what? Yeah, never mind. You just do this. It's like, honestly, this is increasing his strong attack damage. So you don't need to put this one on. If you have a gold, Quint uh, gold Chappie, put that on too. But... If you have to, this is like the most free to play option you can have for him. Honestly, he is 10, 10, 10. So the only issue I know for a fact, I have no green like NAD characters. I know that for a fact. Um, Like literally, I have no green NAD characters. I mean, I have Yuri and like, I think there's one more. But besides that, well, I have her, but again, she's not leveled up sadly. Um, And then one more, I think, him or him, I guess. I do have NAD characters, I guess. They're just not leveled up. Unlucky me, I gotta do that. Oh, wow. Damn, I have a fat amount. I'm not even gonna lie. Damn. My bad, y'all. I gotta get them characters up. But, um, hey, let's get into the showcase now. Let's see what Askin is rocking with. Let's see how good he does in PvE. Because, again, it's been eight months since I've done these showcases. Accessories have blossomed up. They've boomed up. And let's see, like, how good they are now compared to back then eight months ago. So, um, like I said before, he has Squad Zero Killer, which is horrible um in pve like he literally you're never going to fight not even a bosses there's no like squad zero bosses ever so like i don't know i don't know what to tell you i'm actually gonna put on uh mayuri right i'm gonna put him on just to get protect um because i don't want to die and then like you know Mayuri has protect, so I think from now on when I do these showcases, if I know a character that has protect, I'm gonna use it just to protect them. Um, right, protect them is like keep them from taking damage. Protect just um, what's it called? Keeps them from dying, basically. I think I hit, no, I didn't. Okay, I hit somebody there, right? So again, he's a nad character, so mainly we're gonna use his nad. But let's start for strong attack. So. His first strong attack is a little... I like his first strong attack a lot. I really like his first strong attack a lot. Um, again, it's going to take a bit longer, but 
it's like just straight down, right? Let's use an ad. So yeah, eight, seven K there. He has flurry. You got to double that. So that was 14 K, 16 K there. Um, you know, it's good if we use his defense down here, right? So let's use it down and then like, let's hit these enemies. Okay. So 10 K there, right? Um, what was that? Like 10 K there. Yeah, he doesn't have guard break, but again, he's a PVP character. You can't do anything about him. I'm not going to be doing a PVP showcase only because I'm in seat nine. But Askin is really good, right? If you manually play, I would say you can definitely use him for PvE. Again, he has poise, so he's not going to get knocked back or anything like that. Um, he does have some resistance too, so you could use him in IT if you're asking is built like that. Um, so he doesn't have like a full screen uh, third strong attack. Um, again, it doesn't matter only because, again, uh, okay. Let me just get this real quick. Okay. I'm telling you, wrong cards are like the most annoying enemies in this game. Okay, so 19k there. He hit there. What the heck? Okay, now nah, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> He's hitting 20k there. He hit 19k for one of them, I think. Or maybe it was just like... Okay, so that's 8k. 8k. 10k. Right? And then it's third strong attack. He's not pro uh, proccing thing. Oh, we don't have our ultimate because we already used it. So we got to wait literally till the last fight. But Askin is really good. I promise you. Um, Again... Uh, he's not a PvP character or PvE character, so for him to be doing this good in PvE is really good, actually. A lot better than what I remember, um, because the accessories have obviously got better. Um, yeah, so now he's doing like, uh, nah, he's just going crazy, right? Um, you can also poison them too if you can like ever proc it. I don't think we proc'd it once. What the heck? Um, yeah, but if you ever proc poison, then hey. We have protect anyways, but I don't want to die. Obviously, like I'm not gonna just kill myself instantly because we have protect on. But hey, um, having strong attacks obviously for a knight character is very useful when you're not using your knight completely. Um, but obviously with a knight character, if it was range, it'd be a lot better. But he is a PVP character, so I guess not. Okay, let's get his ultimate real quick and play it. I really like his ultimate actually. Okay, we didn't get insta kill there. I kind of wish I had audio for that because I really love when he says "gift the ringo." Um, it's really nice when he says that. But yeah, he's insane. He's a juggernaut, bro. Even I wish I truly wish I could show you guys a PVP showcase, but because my lack of PVP so far, and I'm in seat nine, it's not gonna be anything crazy because you're just gonna guarantee one shot. I mean, my guy. Well, we're fighting bots in seat nine, so we can't do anything about it. But Askin is a really good character. Like I said, these three characters, if you pull them, you're set. They are fantastic characters. Um, like truly fantastic characters. I do recommend summoning. I do want to summon, but I don't at the same time because again, they've confirmed a beyond Bonkai Seifan. Lord knows how long it's gonna take for us to get that actually, but hey, I don't want to risk it. They G drops, I wanna, you know. There's Aizen solo banner too, so I would understand why you would want to skip this. And there's Retsu solo banner. Like, these, this is too much. This banner, I don't think it has anybody, really. I know it's 50 for a step. Does it have anybody? No, I don't care. No, I don't care. No, okay, so, yeah. Like, there are two god-tier solo banners here, and then this Thousand Year Blood War. BBS always has the best banners you can have out at the same time, which is a bit much. But, hey, you can't do anything about it, can you? So, hey, you guys let me know what you guys think about asking. If you pulled him, let me know how much you're enjoying him in PvP and all that stuff. Or PvE if you use him in PvE. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Later, peace. Have a good one.